hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel for those who are new here i'm laura yes i'm laura nyambule arua so most of you know that i traveled to rwanda on the first week was it a fa the first week of february or the second week of february yes and i really had a good time there and today's video is about the budget the transportation and the accommodation so the mode of transport was road we chose modern cost bus which cost us 80 dollars return and took approximately 27 hours from kenya to rwanda there are so many ways on how to get around in Rwanda but the most commonly used are motorbikes, taxis and buses. Bicycles and private cars are also available but are mostly used by residents and citizens. The motorbike was the most convenient and affordable means as for taxis there is Yego and Move Voxiwagon. The Move Voxiwagon is an app and from the residents opinion it's rather expensive than most means. So let's go on to accommodation. We stayed at a place called Kigali Castle, which we booked via booking.com. The hostel charges are $12 bed and breakfast per night. If you are interested in having lunch and supper inside the hostel, it will cost you $7 for both supper and breakfast. So basically, full board will cost you $19. The good thing about living in a hostel, aside from it being affordable, is that you get to meet diverse people from different backgrounds. So let's calculate for the accommodation plus transport. Full board, $19 dollars and if you are to stay for a week it will be 133 dollars transportation from kenya to rwanda is 80 dollars in total it amounts to 213 dollars per person which is very much affordable the other extra cost mostly depends on places to visit i hope this video has been helpful kindly subscribe like comment and share don't forget to always make memories till next time guys bye bye